All right, folks, back again. Yes, the freaking Power Ranger content keeps on coming. We got to talk about freaking Emily Elizabeth. My gosh, I keep on saying Emily. Elizabeth Banks freaking in portrayal of Rita Raposa. Holy crap, man. That is a good portrayal that a good reimagining actually i mean rita is terrifying but they took terrifying to a whole new level it was like they're like oh lord zed Psh, we could freaking top lord zed and they sure freaking do of course i wasn't really intimidated but there was times of where i was like oh fuck <laughs> <laughs> there was really times where I was like, oh, fuck, because she was so she is so definitely intimidating. She is definitely intimidating. I just didn't see intimidation all the way through, you know, kind of like with Ivan Ooze. I know I'm comparing her to Ivan Ooze because Ivan Ooze, as a kid was freaking damn intimidating. It was so damn intimidating. I had to freaking Ivan Ooze putty with his face on it and yeah yeah you can know exactly what happened is that i rarely wanted to touch it and even if i touched it eventually it got dried out and i was able to throw the whole thing out and i'm like oh thank god but freaking damn man he he is still freaking damn intimidating now she she's intimidating definitely oh man i would definitely like to i would like to kind of experiment show this to a kid and see how frightened he is or she is. If I could do that and it's like, oh, well, yep, you have the freaking terrifying factor there. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. It's like, oh, yeah, that would be awesome. But, yeah, she has a terrifying factor. This, I always will point out to this video, this movie, because this movie is exactly how things are done if you actually change the person from what they look like in real life. Tropic Thunder has Tom Cruise, and I could not tell you that Tom Cruise was in the movie. I found out at the end that Tom Cruise was that guy. I'm like, holy frick. I could not tell the difference from this guy at freaking damn all. At all. Now, if someone was in a jerk bag, which, of course, you know how it is. The internet is a jerk bag, and you're like, oh, we cast the Reed Repulsa as Emily Elizabeth Banks, and that's how I know her name. If I was able to just not even know her name, you just allow me to go in there, not even know who it is, and then I get to watch. And then at the end, it's like, holy frick, that was Elizabeth Banks? Holy frick. I'm like, yes, I couldn't tell that was Elizabeth Banks. I could not tell at all. It was crazy how they went from how homeless looking i know it's messed up to say but how homeless looking she was and then how she became i wouldn't say sexy i'm like one thing you shouldn't say about freak ed rita repulsa is that how sexy she is yeah i didn't really get any sex appeal on that so yeah and yeah they did it good because they made it so that it's like yeah she's is rita repulsa and from all the stuff she did, it's like, yeah, she is so not attractive. Oh, my freaking gosh. Make sure if you are dating her not to wear any gold jewelry because you're going to get freaking damn screwed. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, freaking man. Yeah, you, you got to admit her portrayal. That portrayal of Rita Raposa was truly crazy. Not to mention how they decided to spin it. It was, it was awesome. It was a stroke of genius. To me, she kind of seemed like Sailor Pluto, the one that people don't give a crap about anymore. Sailor Pluto always had that rod. I would say rod. I would say staff. I prefer to say staff. If it's not Galaxy Staff, I will just say Galaxy Staff. So she had that. And anyone who's like, oh, no, it's called this. It's like, let me just make the freaking thing I'm trying to say. So anyways, yeah, it's kind of like she was like the freaking Sailor Pluto, where she actually had the staff and the power of what she had in that. It's crazy. The, the craziest part, I do have to admit, and I know I'm 
I'm jumping out of the way and going to another fact. But it's kind of crazy that they never actually showed the morpher in the movie. They decided to create a morpher for us, but they never actually used the morpher to change, though. They only just had the power coin, which is truly crazy. I bet maybe in the next movie, maybe we get to have the morpher. But for right now, yeah. But I have to admit, that was an awesome portrayal. I can't wait. Like I said previously, I can't wait to actually get this movie on Black Friday. I really hope they do it. I really hope they allow me to do it. If they allow me to do it on Black Friday and it actually costs $2, I know. Everyone's like, oh my gosh, you cheapskate bastard. I'm like, yes, I know. But I still want to get this movie, though. I really want to get this movie. It's not like freaking Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the new version of it. Because the new version of it, I'm like, f*** that. F*** the original movie. But as soon as Out of the Shadows came, I'm like, dude, that is an awesome movie. I guess I have to get the prequel, which, as you can see, I could get the prequel for like $2. And I said, f*** that. I said, f*** the first freaking movie. This movie, I'm saying I want this movie. This movie was freaking damn too good and you know what's gonna happen i'm gonna watch this movie every single day oh my gosh it's like i've returned back to a kid again it has been a long time well not really it's not has been a long time because i have played winter soldier multiple times but oh it's been a long time since i got a freaking power ranger movie going to put it in and I'm going to watch it. And chances are I'm going to be crazy enough to do like I did back in the day and watch it a freaking again. Oh my gosh. This was a good movie. If you haven't seen this movie, go watch it now. If you watched it and you're lucky enough to have money to go watch it again, go watch it again. Me personally, because I'm not doing anything. If I had a car and everything and I had money to spend I can tell you I'm going to watch Power Rangers again. I'm actually going to go drive up to that theater again and watch Power Rangers because that was a freaking good movie. Thank you for watching, folks. Stay tuned for the next one because there's going to be a next one.